welcome. Do not forget to hit the like button and subscribe. Exclusive. The headlines 2023. Next president must unite Nigerians. Good luck, Jonathan tells Peter Obi. And as we all know, um, the former president, President Good Luck Jonathan, is the former president of Nigeria, the Federal Republic of Nigeria. He is telling um the presidential candidate of the Labour Party, Peter Obi, that the next president must unite Nigerians. So Good Luck Jonathan tells um, Peter Obi. Former President Gulag Jonathan has told Peter Obi that the Labour Party presidential candidate that whoever emerges the next president must work towards uniting the nation. As we all know, um, President Gulag Jonathan, former President Gulag Jonathan, as um, the former president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, he told Peter Obi that the presidential candidate of the Labour Party that whoever emerges the next president must work towards uniting the nation yeah we want a united nation united we stand we want a united nation a, a nation that you know stands and that is not divided that is what we want but most of the uh, governments our uh, governments in, in this nigeria are not you know in support of we standing um together uniting the nation most of them are, are all about the division of the nation which is not going to help we want a united nation so president Jonathan made this statement on Friday when Peter Obi paid him a courtesy visit, a courtesy visit at his home in Bayesa State. Now Peter Obi went to um uh visited the former president, President Gulag Jonathan, at his home in um, Bayesa State. And this statement was made uh, about uniting Nigeria, was made by the former president of um, Nigeria, President Gulag Jonathan, the former president, former president Gulag Jonathan, was made by Gulag Jonathan to Peter Obi when he paid him a visit um, at his home in Bayesa State, that anybody that emerges as the um, new president come 2023, the person should walk towards, um, you know, trying to unite the nation. Obi was in a state to seek support from the residents in the 2023 um, presidential election. So it was in the state, it was in Bayesa state to seek support from the residents in the 2023 presidential election. He was there to campaign, he was there to tell, uh, you know, try to convince people to vote for him, you know, try to make people see that, yes, he is the right person for the position for the presidential seat. Come 2023, so it was in the state to um, seek support from the residents coming uh, towards the coming of the 2023 presidential election. The former president also said Nigerians must believe in the unity of the of the nation in order to move it forward. So the former president, as uh, the former president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, President Gulag Jonathan, said that um, Nigerians must believe in the unity of the nation. We need to believe in the unity of the nation in order to move it forward. So if we want a better Nigeria, if you are trying to move Nigeria forward, we need to um, believe in the unity of the nation. We need to stand together. We need to stand. We need to be united. Not minding any um cultural, ethnic that you're from, whether you're Igbo, Ausaya, anywhere, any part of Nigeria. We are all Nigerians. So we need to... um believe in the unity of the nation so we can move the nation um forward talking to his verified twitter handle he wrote today i receive in audience members of the presidential campaign council of the labor party led by its presidential candidate mr peter obi so he gave us this information uh, via his um, Twitter handle where he wrote that he received in audience members of the Presidential Campaign Council of the Labour Party that was led by its presidential candidate, Mr. Obi. So they went to Bayesa State to seek support. They went to Bayesa State to, to, you know, try to tell, to seek the support of the residents to vote for him coming um, 2023 election. Um, I reiterated that to move Nigeria forward, we all must see it as our own country and believe in the unity of the nation. So if we want to move Nigeria forward, uh, the president, um, the former president, President Gulag Jonathan, is saying that he's believing in the unity of the nation. Is believing in the unity of the nation. We must all see it as our country. Nigeria is our country. It belongs to every one of us. So not minding your um your tribe, your religion, your culture. Nigeria is one. 
So he said, um, we must all see Nigeria as our own country and believe in the unity of the nation. Whoever becomes the next president must work towards uniting the nation. So whoever, not minding the political party, you know, that you are from, not minding um, the political party that you are from, we need to... um make sure that whoever emerges as the next president of nigeria should um try to make nigeria united must unite work towards uniting the nation i also stressed on the need for a credible election and urge the labor party and all other parties and their supporters to con conduct their campaign peacefully please we are asking that um we conduct campaign peacefully, not minding the political party, whether you are APC, PDP, Labour Party. Please let's try to conduct um campaign peacefully because when when we see uh, when there's a riot or maybe when the uh, polling unit is not safe people will not come out to vote and because of that there can be a division you know i'm not going i'm not doing this so people will not want to come out to vote so we need a credible election we urge all the labor party and all other political parties and their supporters most especially their supporters to conduct the campaign so uh, peacefully because most of the time the supporters are always the one you know trying to cause violence and all of that please not mind anybody that's anybody have the right to support any political party he or she wish or feels that yes is in the best position to move nigeria forward but please let's make sure we have um a campaign that is peaceful so everybody can come out and cast their vote peacefully now according to groove news and unfortunately peter obi cannot unite nigerians but instead further divide the nigerians and polarize the country along religious and ethnic lines we can see him dangerously doing so already due to this desperation for power now this is according to groove news everyone have their own point of view now um according to amechi he said who can un unite the ununited who is able so before you preach unity try to preach justice because it is the injustice which is the beloved son of nigeria that is causing a trade in nigeria please we want um a better nigeria a united nigeria we don't we don't care your ethnic group we are all nigerians united with the nigeria you stand so we want a united nigeria please we want a united nigeria if you're coming across our youtube channel for the first time um independent tv7 um kindly subscribe to our youtube channel in Planet tv7 and if you're a subscriber put on your notification box so you can get exciting news from our channel please let's drop our views in the comment section your views are and our comments are highly appreciated let's drop our views about um president gulog jonathan as the former president of nigeria president gulog jonathan about um whoever emerges as the um the president of nigeria should work towards uniting the nation